Thomas's Bachman Halloween, a Halloween story redub, starring people that will be revealed in the credits later. It was Halloween evening on the island of Sodor, and everyone was working hard. Steggy, the stunt plane, was showing passengers around the island, as were Scarloe and Sully the monster truck. Everyone had already thought of ideas for costumes. Well, except Annie and Clarabelle. I know! Let's be witches! Oh, that's a good idea, Annie! But Jasper, the Spanish brake man, wouldn't hear of it. You must be pulling my wheels! There is no such thing as witches! Oh yeah? We'll see about that, Spanish boy! <laughs> Later that day at the yard, Thomas arrived. He saw Mighty talking to Scarloe. Hi, guys! Oh, hi, Thomas. What's up? Oh, yeah, it's Scarloia talking about ghosts and stuff. <laughs> ghosts? Yes, ghosts. Everywhere. Especially on Halloween. Everywhere you turn, there'll be ghosts. Ghosts here, ghosts there, ghosts everywhere and everywhere else. <laughs> what else is out there? Well, nothing out here but... The Flying Dutchman! The most feared ghost of all time. <laughs> Flying Dutchman? Yes, in fact, I believe he is right behind you. <laughs> nice job, Mighty! You just scared the lunch out of Thomas! Yeah, I did. Well, I better get this candy down to the wharf. Hey, wait for me! Later that evening, Thomas had just brought his last train to the junction. He was eager to leave. <sighs> okay, old boy. There'll be no more ghosts tonight. Huh? What was that? asked Thomas while the camera was shaking around for an unknown reason. Who's there? Uh, leave me alone! If you're a solicitor, I don't want your merchandise! Keep away! I don't want anything to do with you! Trick or treat! Ah! Ouchie! Oops! Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you! Oh, what's the point? No matter how hard I try, I always get scared. Especially on Halloween. I'm just as big a scaredy engine like you, Percy. Is she? Wow, didn't expect to hear that from a popular American icon. Yeah, I... Hey! Oh, sorry, did I say that out loud? Yeah, you did. Well, we can help in any way possible. We can? Wait, actually you can. I've got an idea. A few minutes later. Well, it took a while, but I think I've got it. Thomas was covered up in red paper all the way up to his funnel. He then showed it off to Percy and Toby. Well, guys, what do you think? He asked while a mysterious hand was touching him in a very odd place. Cool! You can just go as my trick-or-treat bag! What?! No, he's not a bag! He's obviously a red carpet for crying out loud! Well, excuse me if I don't have an eye for detail. No, no, no! Not either of those two, you dimwits! I'm the ghost of the Flying Dutchman! Oh! Oh yeah, I knew that. Hey, that reminds me! There's a Halloween party down at Maithwaite Yards! How about a little revenge, Thomas? Hey! Not you, Toby!